Hey YouTube, this is Rose with Pertaining to Rose. Today's topic is create your own rainbows. So sometimes you just gotta step out of the boat and walk on water. But you're not gonna be able to do that unless you take that leap of faith, that that jump, that first step. You know, do you wanna make more money? Apply for that higher position. Even if you're not qualified. You'd be surprised. Sorry, there's air sticking in my phone. <laughs> You'd be surprised what can happen. You know, you might not get the first time around, but now the boss says no. <laughs> She's interested in advancing herself. You might even get lucky and have a boss or two come along and give you a few little helpful hints to get you there a little faster or what they would like to see more of you do, and you'd be surprised. It happens. Sometimes, you know, you want to start doing YouTube. Well, take a video of yourself on your phone and see what you think. Maybe just take a leap of faith and upload it to YouTube. See what happens. It's your first video. We all made huge mistakes in our first video. We all, you know, had that stuttering or that, uh, you know, moment. You all had that. I did too. I made huge mistakes in my first, and I left that video up to remind myself. I was very scared. Very, very scared. And I was making that video for my children and my grandchildren. I don't know what got into me, but I posted it on YouTube, and now I got myself a channel. Actually, got two channels. You know, you got to take that sleep, that uh, step out, and create your own rainbows. If you're depressed and you're feeling lonely, maybe you need to do something that's going to create your own rainbows. Okay, this is what I fancy. Let's just go do for the do it for the day, even if it's just by myself. Sometimes we need that. Sometimes we need to go above and beyond in something and then we realize, huh, oh, it was so much easier than what I thought. I've been putting it off for weeks. But guess what? I'm doing it now. I'm making a change in my life. One little change can dramatically change your life. And it can promote you up in life. You know, it can promote you in many different ways. And once you learn how to start doing that stuff and really thinking about it, okay, I did that, what can I do next? What can I challenge myself to do next? Sometimes creating that one little rainbow you might then turn around and create 20 more. You never know. I'm clueless when it comes to technical stuff. <laughs> I don't care. I'm going to do it anyway. Because what? I enjoy it. I enjoy it. So I'm going to do it anyway. I'm, I'm the slowest learner when it comes to technical stuff. Not good at it at all. But that's okay. Me, I know I'm very mechanically inclined. Now, that's totally different. I can rip down an engine and put it back together. Not very, very many females can say that. You know, I've always been inclined when it comes to fixing things around my house. <laughs> Dryer broke down. Now, let me see. I don't know what that thing is, but we're going to cut out those wires and take it to the store and find out. Yes, I fixed my own dryer. The heating element went out in it. Had no clue what it was. The heater core. Had no idea. Took it to the appliance store and I said, I need one of these. <laughs> the guy started laughing. He goes, do you know what it is? I said, I have no clue. But I said, the wires were burnt the whole way around it. I said, something's going on there. <laughs> he goes, that's your heater core. He goes, I'll get you a new one. And then he brings out the new one and he explains to me how to rewire it, you know, and do the wires and 
so that I don't have no issues down the road. <laughs> he, he really taught me something. But I fixed that dryer all on my own. That's something where I created my own little rain, rainbow. I didn't know I could do it. But I did. And it was a lot of fun once I realized, okay, I can figure stuff out on my own. I can be more independent. I don't need so-and-so to come tromping in here every time I have a problem. I've had a lot of people help me when I had problems. But I always tried to help them when my uh, hot water heater went out and I needed a new one. And of course, I bought the next size up because I wanted the extra hot water. I didn't know nothing about taking out hot water heaters and redoing them. But me and two neighbors all got together and of course it was really heavy and needed to be drained and all that fun stuff. But they helped me and they taught me how to do it. That was a blessing. I learned something new. And then of course I had to do all the insulating and stuff like that and the floor needed built, rebuilt underneath. But they helped me get that all done. Otherwise I wouldn't have known how to do it. I knew what I wanted, and I wanted it done, and they were a blessing for helping me. You know, you do things, and you learn from it. So I cut out a partition of my wall, and I put in a shelf, so it's a built-in shelf, by myself. I made mistakes, but you know what? It looks really cool, and I love it. That was something I did on my own. My sister come home and I have the whole wall cut out. <laughs> I was always doing something like that. You know, I needed to replace the floor underneath my refrigerator. I did that all by myself. I was impressed by myself. I was like, it looks pretty good. I did a good job. I didn't know what I was doing. But I went to Home Depot and I asked questions and they told me what I needed and I did it all by myself. You need to create your own rainbows. You know, your cupboards need repainted. Have fun. Sand them down and repaint them yourself. You don't need to hire somebody to do it. You know, when you take that first step and do it, then you're like, oh, if I did that, I know I can do this. What else can I do? You need to make your own rainbows. Create your own rainbows. Really step out there and do it. It'll change your life. It opened up my mind. It opened up my eyes. I was like, wow. What's going on here? It, it really blessed me. I was like, oh, if I could do that, I could do this. I, I might have to figure it out, but that's okay. I can do it. So there's a lot of stuff I'm learning. So I don't edit my videos and I don't do the thumbnails and but that's okay with me. You know, I'm slowly learning different little techniques and tricks and I was like someday I'll get there. I'm okay with that. I'm not gonna worry myself about it. That's okay. We're we're growing together. So make sure you comment on this video and tell me what you did to create your own rainbow to change your life in any little form did you do something new did you step out on faith you know take that little leap you know what did you do to to make your life better i love my comments i read them all the time and my comments help me too if i don't follow you and you're somebody new then after you leave a comment, I can click on your picture and follow you right back. That makes it so much easier. And other subscribers can see your comment and say, huh, I wonder who that is, and click on your picture, and they can follow you too. It's really important to leave comments in people's videos because it don't just help them grow, but it helps you grow also. And the more people that like your comment, people are going to start noticing. Why'd that person get so many likes on their comment? Maybe I should go check out this person. 
and they click on it. They click on your picture. Boom. What comes up? Your channel. Start making the little differences in life and see what happens. Just change one thing today and change one thing tomorrow and see what happens. So you're going to have tremendous growth. It might be mental growth. It might be physical growth. It might be spiritual growth. It might be financial growth. It might be a healthy lifestyle growth. You never know. But that one little change, that one little droplet, just one little drop of water, adds up over time. And you get tremendous growth from it. Create your own rainbows. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Tell me what you think. Definitely comment below. I love you, YouTube. Bye.